I'm really sorry about the screwy schedule. I mean, I had some trouble updating my videos because I've been so busy, and I've had and I've tried to up trying to update ones that from like days ago, and so that's why you may find multiple videos posted on one day, and sometimes days I don't post videos at all. But but yeah, so sorry about that. But in the meantime. You can sit back and relax with my great movie review of Batman Forever. It's the third Batman movie and the first one that Tim Burton did not did not direct, but he did produce it. And um, I think I read somewhere that he hated the title because he thought it was a very stupid title. Yeah. And but my dad watched it and he saw it was great. He saw I even heard him say, "This is how all Batman movies should be like." And he saw Jim Carrey was great as the Riddler. And, um, yeah. Although, one interesting interesting fact about the movie is that while, um, in the first Batman movie, Bill, movie Harvey Dent was played by, um, Billy D. Williams, a black guy. In the movie, he's played by Tommy Lee Jones, which, um, means they may, may not, means they, they probably don't take place in the same continuum. Continuity, or Harvey Dent and Two Face are two exactly different people. Yeah, or maybe they just um, change the races around. But yeah, and now, this is also the first Batman movie to have a have Robin in it, and um, Robin, Robin the um, the sidekick. We basically get to see a lot. We get to see Robin's backstory. He was a circus. A circus of brat and his parents were killed along with the rest of his family so Batman decides to adopt him and take him in as Robin yeah and um yeah so I think this is a um very cool movie not to the extent of the of the um early Batman movies but still fairly cool and um yeah um and with um, Two Face, they basically have not only half his face burned, but his other half is more funkier, like an Elton John suit, and while his other half is just a normal guy. I think that's just a very cool, and kudos to the special effects person. Yeah, I give this movie about um, three and a half stars out of five. It's a pretty cool Batman movie. <coughs> Bye.